Ever wonder how much Tesla stock you'll need to buy before you can retire and enjoy life? You're in the right place if you have. Make sure to watch all the way through as we go into great length about this subject in this video. Please remember to subscribe to our channel and leave a like. You are probably well aware that Kathy Wood has a reputation for supporting Tesla stock and its prospects for sustained development. She has previously complimented the management team of the business, highlighting their capacity for effective capital allocation. This includes their choice to repurchase shares, which she has backed as a way to give shareholders their money back and maybe raise the stock. Price. Actually, ARK Invest, the investment company owned by Kathy Wood, has long held a sizable stake in Tesla stock. This implies that she thinks the company is well positioned for growth in the upcoming years and has a high degree of confidence in its future prospects. Upon reflection, it would seem plausible that Kathy Wood would be supportive of Tesla's intention to undertake another buyback, considering her prior endorsement of this tactic and her long-term bullish view of the firm. Her exact opinions on the subject haven't been made public, so it's important to keep in mind that she might wait to make a decision before disclosing further information. It's not reasonable to infer that she intends to take part in this buyback. So if you had the opportunity to purchase Tesla shares, how would you respond? To what extent would you have to truly retire before you could begin? To retire by 2030, how many Teslas do you need? Let's find out. If full self-driving technology costs $8,000 in 2020, $10,000 in 2021, and $12,000 in 2022, it will probably cost $28. It appears that Tesla is raising the cost of its FSD by $2,000 annually. This demonstrates their belief that FSD will be a profitable venture for them if it materializes, which appears likely. We receive $28,000 as a one-time payment by increasing by $2,000 yearly till 2030. Some research indicate that they may reach $64, which is a confirmed truth by 2031. Tesla will be another moneymaker for them. If it occurs, all it is is software with a massive upsell and they benefit handsomely from it. Thus, by 2030, we'll leave it at $62. Sales of the car and FSD make up the whole revenue. These days, every car sold here costs $50,000. Due to supply and demand, it's a little bit higher, but to be safe, we'll assume that the average car sold by 2030 will cost $50,000. Although the actual percentage is closer to 30%, the cars are listed at 25%. Every car sold will result in $1.5 billion in profit shares before they are split. It's okay this sum. It will alter in June, July, or October when they announce the stock split. It seems improbable that they will have $1.5 billion outstanding shares by 2030 because they are producing so much money that they wouldn't need to dilute that many shares. In fact, they need to be paying out dividends or buying back stock, but Tesla has said that it isn't interested in doing either. $1.5 EPS is pre-split and comes after standing shares. P was kept as realistic as feasible at 40 and EPS will be adjusted when the stock split occurs. I predict that Tesla's price will be less than 40 by 2030, and probably more than 50. In North America, the average monthly cost is more than $5,000 or $3,000 for a family of two. Let's play the selfish part in this video and claim you wish to retire the shares on your own. That is a whole unrelated tale. The average monthly cost decreases to just over $3,200 or $40,000. We arrive at $4,020 after deducting the $3,200 monthly. Expense and projecting an average inflation rate of 3% through 2030, However, let's imagine that you want to have some fun rather than lead a minimal lifestyle. The SP 500 yields between 8 and 10% yearly, but let's be cautious and estimate 7%. If you choose to take $5,000 out of the SP's yearly return of 7%, you will have $850,000 by 2030. It's amazing that you can live up to 50 years if you sell your Tesla shares for about $850,000 and invest the proceeds in the SP 500. Now that we know that investing in Tesla is best done in the mid to late 40s with a target of $850,000 and an estimated return of 7%, we can concentrate on figuring out how much we need to pay each month. Food and auto sales are the only two industries that are visible in the data, including our estimates for energy, insurance, or Tesla's other endeavors, such robo taxes or solar panels, we do not yet have sufficient data. However, we do have something dependable and sturdy to live off of. By 2030, you must have $850,000 in our portfolio. Um, for $5,000 every month for 50 years. In the worst case, we would only need to invest about $98,000 for 98 shares of Tesla stock in order to accomplish this. This investment should return at least 7%, assuming that the market stays stable with a commitment to prudent saving, investing, and avoiding unnecessary spending. We can worry free. Retire in eight years, we require 79 shares in the base case, which would come with a price tag of about $79,000. If Tesla sells 25 million cars, our investment might return 10 times in eight years or up to 66 times if they sell 30 million. If you are an investor, you should wait for the market to recover as it always does rather than logging in during a market drop. 
Our current predictions do not account for other efforts like solar energy storage or Tesla insurance. They only take into account the company's car sales and fully autonomous driving capabilities. One of the most well-known accounts of significant profits from Tesla buybacks is connected to Kathy Wood's investment company, ARK Invest. In 2019, ARK Invest boldly predicted that within the following five years, the price of a share of Tesla stock might reach $4,000 based on their evaluation of Tesla's potential to rule the electric car market and other associated businesses, as well as the effect of the company's stock. Price buybacks, they made this prediction. Since then, ARK Invest has profited greatly from the sharp rise in Tesla's stock price. In fact, some reports claim that since 2017, ARK Invest's investment in Tesla has increased by more than 1,100%, with Tesla's buybacks accounting for a sizable amount of this gain. The company's stock price has also increased significantly as a result of Tesla's own buyback program. Following the announcement of plans to repurchase up to $5 billion in shares in 2020, Tesla's stock price has experienced a significant increase. With a market valuation of more than $1 trillion as of early 2023, Tesla is among the most valuable businesses in the entire globe. All things considered, a major contributor to Tesla's recent expansion and success has been the company's repurchase program's effectiveness and the boost it has given to the stock price. It is crucial to remember that these estimates are predicated on cautious approximations and hypotheses. However, we can anticipate Tesla's long-term existence because it is a valuable company and a top problem solver. In conclusion, we simply need a tiny amount of Tesla shares to retire with them. We can attain financial stability and peace of mind by making prudent investments and keeping a long-term outlook in mind. We appreciate you watching this video on the required amount of Tesla shares to retire and live a comfortable life. Long-term growth opportunities abound when investing in Tesla and ARK Invest the investment. A firm led by Kathy Wood has amassed a sizable holding of Tesla stock. Although Kathy Wood's exact opinions on Tesla's repurchase plans are unknown, it is safe to presume that she may have a positive opinion given her past endorsement of the plan and her optimistic view of the business. It's critical to examine your long-term financial objectives and the amount you'll need for a comfortable retirement if you plan to take part in this buyback. Having said that, never forget that investing entails dangers, and it's essential to speak with a financial expert before making any decisions about your money. Remember to subscribe to our channel and give this video a huge thumbs up for more thought-provoking videos just like it. See you in the next one, we hope. A firm led by Kathy Wood has amassed a sizable holding of Tesla stock. Although Kathy Wood's exact opinions on Tesla's repurchase plans are unknown, it is safe to presume that she may have a positive opinion given her past endorsement of the plan and her optimistic view of the business. It's critical to examine your long-term financial objectives and the amount you'll need for a comfortable retirement if you plan to take part in this buyback. Having said that, never forget that investing entails dangers and it's essential to speak with a financial expert before making any decisions about your money. Remember to subscribe to our channel and give this video a huge thumbs up for more thought-provoking videos just like it. See you in the next one, we hope firm led by Kathy Wood has amassed a sizable holding of Tesla stock. Although Kathy Wood's exact opinions on Tesla's repurchase plans are unknown, it is safe to presume that she may have a positive opinion given her past endorsement of the plan and her optimistic view of the business. It's critical to examine your long-term financial objectives and the amount you'll need for a comfortable retirement if you 